All right, so I'm just out performing at the mall. Now, you guys, just be super honest. I just basically approached you and said, hey, I'm a magician. Let, let's get this shit started. Yeah? Yeah. And that's why she's grinning so much, because she likes bluntness. And so does this guy. Am I right? Oh, shit. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay to be a little embarrassed. So we'll try this. Uh, Amanda, could, could you do me a favor and just hold on to the pack of cards like this? Now, we're going to try something with you. Hold out your hands like this for me. Just a bit. Perfect. And do this. Do you know what that's called? Yes, and that's the first round of applause. Thank you, buddy. It's great. <laughs> uh, okay, but go and take your hands like this. And imagine like you're trying to crush something like really solid, like a steel or a lump of coal. You're trying to break it, right? Like a vice grip. Now hold your fingers as you vice grip and hold them out like this. And I want you to imagine as if they're magnets. And imagine how that would feel if they begin to push together. Almost as if there's an invisible force just pushing them right together. It's kind of weird, isn't it? You want to watch this. As soon as I tap the shoulder, they'll go twice as fast. Now. There they go, jumping right together. Now, I, I know that's a weird feeling. Now, you can feel the tension here, so I want you to imagine, because you can feel it here, can't you, that tension. Now, imagine it's going to travel up, all the way through this arm, make its way around the shoulder, all the way deep down inside, from the leg down to the toe, back up around, and all the way back here. Now, can you still feel the tension here? Yeah. Now, spread it, now, spread them apart again, this time, they'll go even faster. And as soon as they touch, imagine if you cannot separate them. Imagine if they were so stuck you could not just separate them. In fact, try to separate and find them just keep sticking and gluing and locking them right together as if they've been vice and super cool. It's the most weird sensation. It's, it's super strange. Now watch. As soon as they just go, they unstick, which is a bit weird. Now, now I, I want to be honest with you. All right, now, have you ever had something on your mind? Maybe go to like a separate room to eat a sandwich or grab a drink, watch a movie. I'm assuming, have you seen the Lock and Key yet? The, the new uh, Netflix series? Yeah. It's, it's fucking great, right? Now watch this. Now, I want you to imagine the last time you felt really confused, like you know, when you had a dream from the night before and you're like, you know, you try to remember it and it goes from your mind, right? Imagine that's happening to you now. Imagine what you feel when you physically can't remember something. It only starts in the stomach, it doesn't. It just starts here. It's going to start to move its way up. Just imagine as if I could take your name and just throw it away completely. Try try to say your name now and find it just completely goes. It's almost like a blank slate. And the more you try to say it, the further it goes. Keep on trying. The more effort you try to remember, the further it goes from your mind. What? Try, try, try to say what's your name. That's fine. Nah, bro. This ain't fucking funny, bro. Dude, I got it. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and uh, if you stop imagining, your name should come back now. What's your name? Brock. There you go. 